Welcome back to Comigan TV, the only place on YouTube where all geek culture collides. I'm Shannon, and today on the show, we're going to be taking a look at the Funko Pop Movies, Movie Moments, Ghostbusters, 35th Anniversary, Banquet Room. This is number 730. So as you can see, this is a pretty large box. Comparing it to a standard size Funko Pop, it is a little bit bigger, like maybe an, uh, about an inch bit taller. Uh, which makes it a little bit harder to display if you stack your pops on top of each other. I know I reviewed the uh, Gozer, Keymaster, and Gatekeeper pops uh, a while back. And they were the same height as a regular Funko Pop, uh, just longer. Which made them easier to display, especially when you stack them on top of each other. Um, this, however, being a little bit taller than the others... You really have to make some special room for it. So anyway, let's go ahead and take a look at the back of the box. All it is is uh, a picture of the banquet room scene. Of Peter and Egon uh, trapping Slimer. As you can see, there's green light coming, shining on him from behind. Uh, with the city of New York in the background. Very cool. And I am really enjoying that uh, 35th anniversary Ghostbusters logo. That is really cool. So anyway, let's go ahead and take it out of the box. And take a look at this amazing scene. Okay, so first things first. It does come with a two-piece clamshell that just snaps apart. Go ahead and set that off to the side for now. And we'll go ahead and turn it around right there, just like that. Zoom in a little bit. There we go. All right, and this looks really nice. Uh, they did have to put it on a platform, uh, keep it all together because, you know, it's got the proton streams uh, wrap going from the proton wands around Slimer and then the uh, trap coming up. I really like how they made like a transparent stand for Slimer. Uh, that looks like energy from the trap. That looks really cool. You see the slime on Peter. Um, and it does look like they used a different sculpt for Peter from the uh, from the individual one. Uh, his wand is a little bit more raised, whereas as I showed you guys in the uh, last video, uh, his wand is more relaxed. Teach you to slime a guy with a positron collider, huh? <laughs> Uh, and their heads do rotate a little stiff on Egon. They do rotate. Rotate. Very cool. I like the really shiny green paint they use for Slimer. Uh, do his arms move? No. Very cool. See, it's got a, some forks, a spoon, some broken dishes. Uh, and some garbage on the floor. Very nice. Um, it's got this plastic piece here. It just comes off. There. That's just uh, for some extra support for the uh, proton streams. And then you got the trap here. Uh, it would have been nice if they made it a little bit longer and included the other two Ghostbusters. Showed Ray uh, getting uh, stepping on the uh, switch to the trap. But maybe they'll add some side pieces so that you can put them together if if you display your pops out of the box. I don't, but that would be really cool. Uh, when I got this, I did have the chance of getting the Peter outside the firehouse pop as well but I had already spent way too much money in GameStop as it was so I was not able to get it uh, and then last time I went into GameStop they had a massive stay puffed Funko pop just massive that I really wanted but I have nowhere to store him to, for, to display him uh, I have a really small house, really small room 
that is covered with my collections already. Uh, I don't think uh, I don't think I'll be able to get that pop for quite some time. But I really love how they added the slime onto Peter. Uh, very nice. I love that shade of green. Uh, that's always been my favorite color. Uh, the green, the Slimer. That 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 is my favorite color right there. Uh, I know there are many different shades of green, and I could easily say, be a generic and just say green is my favorite color, but no, it no, slime green is my favorite color. Very cool. I love how they at, made separate streams. The uh, blue. Uh, almost electricity wrapping around the red uh, nuclear energy type deal for both of them and then the pink and clear energy coming out of the trap really nice um, I think they should have maybe put a little bit more distressed look on Slimer's face though I don't know that's just me though what do you guys think so anyway, there you have it, guys. Funko Pop Movies Banquet Room from the Ghostbusters 35th Anniversary Movie Moments number 730. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Stay tuned next time when we take a look at the 89 Tim Burton Batman Funko Pop. Take care, my friends. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you hit the subscribe button right there so you can stay up to date on all things geek culture. Also, make sure you check out one of these two playlists on the side for videos just like the one you just watched. I'm Shannon for Comic Getting TV, the only place on YouTube where all geek culture collides. Take care, geeks.